Johnson decided to begin working on his Great Society program to ensure that black Americans would have a good reason to vote for Democrats in the future. His plan was to have American taxpayer money dispersed primarily among the black community in particular, but also poor whites, who were all generally impoverished and less educated. However, the expansion of government and a strategy focused on handouts that discouraged self-improvement caused more harm than good, and it did not help the poor. Five decades later, after President Johnson initiated the war on poverty, America remained at around the same percentage of people still living in poverty as it did back then. In 1964, the poverty rate was approximately 19%. Today, it's around 15%, said Project 21 spokesman Derek Green in 2014. Statistics such as these demonstrate the war on poverty was a continually mismanaged disaster. That isn't to say there haven't been people helped by it. All things considered, however, it's been a tragedy.